Welcome everyone to the Tactical Tavern. I'm your host, Tomas Salas, and in this video, we are reviewing the CIA Covert Cutter. This is a virtually undetectable multi-tool, and we're gonna see if it has what it takes to earn the Tactical Tavern seal of approval. By the end of this review, you will have the necessary information to decide whether or not this is right for your everyday carry or next secret mission. With that being said, let's cut into it. Before we begin, if you love gadgets gear and upgrading your everyday carry with unique accessories, take a moment to drop a like and subscribe for more content like this. All right, first up is price, and at the time of this review, you can find the CIA Covert Cutter for just $14.99. For that money, you get a tool that is comprised of GV3H, which is 30% glass nylon and made in Switzerland. We can thank the superb geometry to Jackie Collins, and as a tribute to him, his name is engraved in the handle. On one side of this knife, you have a plain edge, and on the other side is the scalloped serrations. What I really enjoy is that these scalloped serrations certainly increase your ability to saw through fibrous materials. Although this knife is extremely thin it is very well contoured in the handle and it locks into place in a forward and a reverse grip with that thumb cap as well as being able to hold solid into place with that thumb rest for repeated Amazon package opening. I'm really a big fan of that smooth integration of the thumb hole because it easily allows for a lanyard attachment or being able to hang this for concealment specifically in the shower. Again, it's made out of composite material, so this knife is impossible to rust. It's non-magnetic or metallic. Built into the design of this knife is an integrated pocket clip, so that way you can just simply toss this into your pocket or hide it behind your sock. A lot of people might be worried about carrying it around in this fashion, and if you really are worried about that, you can easily fabricate a sheath out of some cardboard and duct tape. However, in my testing, I've carried it around numerous times and not have any issues with it poking through, yet it is quickly deployable in forward and reverse grip. Through my testing, I found this is extremely easy to lacerate through jeans into a cardboard pile, and including some organic medium, as well as serving as a great picnic knife. In my testing, I was able to saw through a piece of rope. However, it did need a little bit of touch up on that edge, specifically those serrations and flat side, but you're also easily able to do that on a regular cement block. Obviously, if you wanted to take that edge to the next level, you could certainly try that out on some sandpaper and really fine tune it to your heart's desire. However, I think the maiden voyage is certainly for plunging capability, and for that, it absolutely passes. This CIA covert cutter is non-absorbent, non-metallic, non-magnetic, and it makes an excellent addition to the toolbox for anyone working in an EOD type environment, a secret mission, or regular people that just want a shower knife capable of self-defense if you're caught off guard. So let me know your thoughts. Do you think this is worth adding to your everyday carry for those types of environments or having at your desk or even in your shower? If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to drop a like, share, and subscribe because it helps support the channel and it is greatly appreciated. While you're there, turn on post notifications so you are the first to know of new videos coming every Tuesday and Thursday. Also, take a moment to follow us on Instagram at Tactical Tavern to get a behind the scenes look, new gear, the testing process, and some fun content you won't want to miss. With that being said, my name is Tomas Salas. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. And remember, be prepared, be practical, stay tactical.